Oh man, is the bathroom still not free? No man, I've been waiting for like 10 minutes. That long, huh? Yeah, I feel like the people want Super Mario Sunshine 2, waiting for something that's never gonna happen. Yeah, it must be tough, man. Beats doing work, I suppose. True, but I really gotta pee. Yeah, I do too. I wonder what this guy's even doing in there. Well, you assholes, keep it down out there! Hey, how long we got left of our break? We got about 10 more minutes, man. Aww, oh, it feels like we just got out here. I know, man. I'm so exhausted from lugging around those barrels all day. Weren't you lifting great barrels today? They're heavier than they look, man. Whatever. Guess we better start heading back or Kayla will lose it with us. Yeah, last time we were late, we were stuck sweeping the lunchroom all afternoon. We wouldn't have been late if someone hadn't insisted we stop for a snack. I was hungry, okay? Hey, what's that smell? We just talked about this, we are not stopping for burgers. Doesn't smell like burgers, man. It's unlike anything I've ever smelt before. Huh, come to think of it, I smell it too. <sighs> Looks like it's coming from this tree. Really? It's not like the tree's the only thing of interest here. Damn, what type of fruit is that? I have no idea, man. I've never seen anything like it before. Oh well, I'ma try one. What? No, it could be poisonous, man! It doesn't smell poisonous. Neither does shampoo, but I don't drink that. Stop panicking, Diddy. What would the world be like if no one ever tried apples? Well, then that part of the Bible of the Garden of Eden would have gone very differently. You need to calm down, man. Fine, try one, but if you start choking to death, don't come crying to me. Oh no. DK, no! Help! My, my brother's dying! <laughs> that was awesome! What the- oh god damn it, man! The fruit actually tastes really nice. Here, try one. Okay. Wow, that actually tastes really good. I know, right? It's like taking a bite out of the rainbow or something. Yeah, I swear it can taste like five different flavors in this. Hey, we could bring some of these back to the warehouse and show the others. Good call, man. Don't eat any more, though, or there won't be enough left for everyone. Huh? Hey, oh, look who's finally back! What took you guys so long? Carol's been going nuts all afternoon. We were trying to carry this fruit back to the warehouse. What on earth are those? I've never seen fruit like that before. We're not sure, but it tastes amazing. Yeah, you guys should try it. Sure, let's see what they're like. I don't know, Dixie. We don't know where that's been. It can't be worse than the crap they give us in the lunchroom. Yeah, man, stop being a puff. Give us one here. Mmm, wow. But the hell, man, sweet as hell. Yeah, I don't even know how to describe it. You've got to try some chunky. <sighs> I don't want to. There could be worms inside. Come on, man. I was worried at first, too, but it's really nice. Yeah, don't be so scared of a bloody fruit. <sighs> Fine, take a bite. Well? That was amazing! I haven't tasted anything like it! See? Told you they were good. Yeah, it's like I just got a taste of heaven. Got any more? Well, there's this tree that's growing them somewhere in the jungle center. Oh! Well, he was easily convinced. What's going on, guys? I just saw Chunky running through the corridor. Oh, DK and Diddy found this fruit. Yeah, man, you should try one! Huh, this is a weird-looking apple. It's not an apple, Tiny. We're not exactly sure what it is. Are you sure it's not just a really weird apple? Just take a bite, Tiny. Wow, that was great! Where can I buy these? We didn't buy them, they were growing on a tree. Hold on, you can get fruit that grows on trees? Why do you think they have seeds in them, Tiny? 
I don't know. I just figured people put them there. Maybe we should try get Carol to sell some of these for us. You really think he'd be on board? Doubt it. He hates bananas because they're too hard to open. You might as well try imagine the credit you'd get discovering them. That is true, man. Okay, I suppose it's worth a shot. Why am I still getting emails from Twitter? I ain't even used it in over a year! Oh hey, look who finally decided to show up! Wait, we're here to explain. Well you got two minutes to explain why I shouldn't have you two sweeping floors all afternoon, so better be good! Well, for one, we're not even that good at it. Yeah, and there was a lot of traffic. In the middle of the jungle?! Yeah, the truck driver seemed really confused about where he was going. Anyway, we found this weird looking fruit. You think I give a crap about that? You guys were skipping work! I could fire you if I wanted to! Come on, boss, just try it. It's really delicious. I got a business to run! I don't have time to sit here and taste any foods! I suppose you're too busy drinking beer and watching videos all day. What did you just say?! Nothing! Come on, boss. I promise, they're really good. Ugh, fine. Give me one. Well, how was it? It's incredible! See? Told you you'd like them. Like them? They're amazing! Do they have a name? I don't think so. Why? We gotta grow more of these! Let's call them... Crapples! Crapples? Yep, I'm naming them Crapples! That's like naming a child Northwest. Great find, you two! You know, we could sell these bad boys! Wait, for real? Yeah, people would pay good money for a new fruit! We could even make it into juice, ice pops, and everything! Great find, boys! Thanks, boss. Again, sorry about being late. Ah, it's cool. You boys can go home, actually. Wait, really? Awesome! Don't mention it, boys. You know where I can find more of these? Yeah, there's a few trees growing them near the jungle center. Ah, I see. Well, have a good day, boys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Again, thanks, boss. Ha 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 ha! No problem. Crusha! Clump! What's up, boss? Assemble the team! We got some Crapple smoothies to make! I'm sorry, did you just say Crapples? <sighs> just get the workers. How come I didn't get to go bloody early? You mean you actually have to work to get to leave early? Man, what a shock! It's just because we showed K. Rule the fruit we found. Yeah, he really seemed to like it. I can see why, man! It's delicious! Uh, yeah, it's amazing! Hey, don't eat too many of those guys. Yeah, man. We might need to grow some more. Oh, don't worry about that! That boss of yours is probably growing hundreds of them! He makes a good point, man. Yeah, man. I got some more of that juice. I'm bloody thirsty. Ah, uh, do I always have to do everything around here? You know, Diddy, I bet since we discovered Crapples, K. Rule's gonna give us a lot of extra credit. You really think so? Yeah, man. They're gonna be good for the business, and we help discover them. Yeah, you're right. We might even get a pay raise. Boy, we could use one of those. We could finally afford to fix that leak in the bathroom. Just don't leave us in the dark if you guys blow up, man. Of course not, man. We've been friends since middle school. Yeah, man. Besides, you're the only one that can drive. Thanks, that makes me feel so important. Bet Dixie will be impressed with you when this blows up. Come on, man. All we did was find a fruit. Yeah, one of the best fruits I've ever tasted! Yeah, man, think of all the dust you'll get! Lasses will be lining up just to speak to you, man! I don't know. Dixie's not really like that. She's cool. I think someone's in love. <laughs> Piss off. The hell are you kids rambling about? Oh, sorry, Grandpa. We'll try to keep it down. You better, you noisy little assholes! What the hell's this weird-ass fruit you're eating? They're called crapples. Want one? You millennials and your stupid new fruits and trends! Back in my day, we ate what we were told! Yeah, and look at the state of you now! You better watch yourself if you don't want to be living on the street, Ripper Snapper! Geez, Tiny, you gotta slow down on the crapple daiquiri. But it tastes so good! It's like the ultimate combination of sweet and sugary! Right... Anyway, what's going on with you? Oh, not too much. Crush has been pissing me off recently. Which one of them's Crusha again? The big blue Kremlin in the tank top. Gotcha. So what's up? Well, I like hanging out with him. And he's pretty cool. 
but he never really pays any attention to what I talk about. He's always just talking about himself and telling me stupid stories like he thinks he's Travis Scott. Like what? One time, he talked for hours about some stupid beef he had with some guy from his high school. Why did he spend so long talking about his dinner? <sighs> it's not important. We're supposed to be meeting later tonight. But he hasn't texted me back yet. Hmm, I wonder what he's up to. Ah, now this is what I'm talking about. Boss, can we go home now? We were supposed to leave two hours ago. Yeah. I'm supposed to be meeting Dixie today. And I'm not even sure I locked the door when I left the trailer. You think I care about your social lives? I need more crapples! Well, I already told her I was busy twice this week. If I use that excuse a third time, she's not gonna believe me. Well, you should have been more creative with your excuses, asshole. Now get back in there and plant those crapple seeds. Ugh, fine. But if I get dumped, I'm taking a week off. <laughs> Man, these crapples are gonna make me stinking rich. Awesome, but uh, what about DK and Diddy? Aren't they the dorks you discovered it? Are you seriously still here? So, any news back from Cable yet, you guys? No, not yet. It's been a while since we heard back from him, actually. Oh well, I'm sure he will. We were the ones who discovered crapples, after all. You know, man, there's no need to bloody gloat about it. Oh well, thanks for inviting them anyway. They didn't invent them, they discovered them. Sounds like someone's jealous they didn't find them first. Can one of you buy me some more? I didn't bring enough money with me. You need to stop, Tiny. You're going to blow all our money on crapples. Yeah, man, save some for the rest of us. Or because it's unhealthy? It's a fruit. It can't be that unhealthy. Can't argue with that. Hit me up with a couple too. You'll get one when you start paying with your own money. Hey, you guys enjoying your drinks? Yeah, man, this stuff's great. You know, Funky, we're the ones who discover crabbles. What? <laughs> Sorry, I don't think so, man. What? We did. Yeah, me and DK found them together. Nah, dude. Did you see it on the news? Yeah, the news. That's what we watch. Just look, man. Good evening, everyone. Hope you're all having a lovely Saturday. Today, I am visiting K. Rule Incorporated. The business that discovered the island's widely popular new fruit, known as the crapple. People all over the island have been going crazy over it. Ever since I started eating crapples, I've never felt better. I've never tasted something so sweet yet so healthy. Get that damn camera out of my face! I'm trying to buy groceries! And who's to thank for the discovery of this amazing, nutritious new fruit? Why, none other than the head of the company, business conglomerate Connor Christensen Rule. Hey, what the hell? Calm down, guys. Maybe they'll mention that it was me and Diddy who found it. So, Mr. K. Roll, how did you discover this amazing new fruit? I was just closing the warehouse down after a hard day of work, and as I was walking home, I stumbled upon this weird fruit. I decided to taste it, and as I ate it, I knew I had to share this taste with the amazing people of the island. Oh, never mind. Well, that's a very inspiring story, Connor. Thanks so much for sharing it with us. No problem. Just remember, when you're feeling blue, just kick back with the crapple. Even his slogan's bloody awful. For more information about Connor Rule, be sure to buy his new autobiography, Did It All Myself, coming February 7th. What the hell? We discovered that fruit, not him! Yeah, man, is he taking the bloody piss? I can't believe he'd do something like this. Me neither, but he's gonna hear about it. I wouldn't, guys. He owns the whole business. Chunky's right. You guys could get into serious trouble. We gotta say something. We were the ones who discovered them. Yeah, man. He's making money off our discovery. Our discovery? I don't even want to buy Crapples now if it's gonna be giving him money. What? No, I didn't agree to that. It's okay, guys. It's not a problem with us if you still want to buy Crapples. Phew, that's a relief. We're still gonna have a word with him, though. K. Rule, we need to talk. Who the hell led you in here without my permission? We're a crusher and clump! So, uh, what time are we supposed to be going back to the warehouse again? I think a lunch break ended 15 minutes ago. Oh, you want another drink then? Make it two. I ain't driving. 
We want a word with you. Well, can't it wait? I'm trying to watch hand- I mean, uh, finish these reports. It's urgent. Fine, I'll finish these reports later. What's up? Well, we watched the news yesterday. Good for you, what do you want, a medal? We saw your interview about Crapples. Oh, right. Yeah, that was awesome. Those Crapples are selling faster than Yoshi's Crafted World at Target. Quit playing dumb with us, man. Yeah, you know we were the ones who discovered the Crapple. We brought them to you. You were refusing to try them until we persuaded you. You wouldn't even know how great they are if it wasn't for us. Hey, I'm the head of the company here. It's my warehouse, and you guys are my workers. So if you guys discover something, you discover it for me. What? That makes about as much sense as the time travel in Avengers Endgame. Too bad, Diddy. I'm the one growing and selling them, so as far as the public is concerned, I'm the one who found them. End of discussion. What? That's bullcrap. You can't just take credit for something you didn't do! Who are you, Carlos Mencia? Oh boo-hoo! Cry me a river, why don't ya? The least you could do is mention to the people that we were the ones who found it and brought it to you. That ain't gonna make me any more money now, is it? Neither does eating four meals a day, but you still insist on doing that. That's enough out of you, asshole! Now, I'd suggest you get back to packing crapples! Oh yeah? Or what? Or you're fired, that's what! Oh. That is hard to argue with. Fine, we'll go. But eventually, someone's gonna find out the truth. Oh, why don't you tell someone who cares? And then he told us if we tell anyone that we discovered them, we'll lose our jobs. Man, that sucks. Sorry, guys. It's whatever. I wasn't expecting any sort of pay raise anyway. So he can just get away with screwing you guys over like that? What else can we do, Dixie? Yeah, he literally owns the business. He could fire every single one of us if he wanted to. Oh no, that sounds bloody horrible. Shut up, Lanky! Unlike you, some of us actually want to keep our jobs. Calm down, you puff. I was only joking. I still can't believe he's doing this. He shouldn't be able to get away with screwing over his employees like that. Yeah, now we know what it feels like to work at Amazon. I don't see why it matters. They taste amazing anyway. Uh, Tiny, I'd lay off on the crapples if I were you. You're looking a little bigger than before. Relax, I only gained like 144 pounds. That's more than Diddy wears at all. Thanks for bringing that to everyone's attention. Hey, Dixie. How's it going? Oh, good. Thanks, Crusher. How's business? Pretty good, yeah? Crapples have been making us a lot of extra money. Most of that was probably tiny. I can't help it! They're amazing! I know, right? Finally, a fruit that doesn't make me sick. Yeah, I'm glad the boss discovered them. Actually, it was DK and Diddy who discovered them. Yeah, we found them growing on a tree on the way back to the warehouse. Why, you two? <laughs> Fat chance. Yeah, Kate Rose the one who discovered them. Please, he hasn't even discovered Discord yet. Yeah, man, he eats bananas because he can't bloody peel him. He's not wrong, dude. He still uses Internet Explorer. He has better watch himself. Talking threats about the bots. And what are you, his professional ass kisser? They were the ones who discovered Crapples, Crusher. Yeah, they showed them to us before K. Rool even found out about them. Yeah, sure. It's Jack and Sill, some M. Sandler's pets work. Hey, I enjoyed it. You enjoy eating food off the floor? Whatever, it doesn't matter who discovered Crapples anyway. Don't worry, we know you guys discovered it. Yeah, you guys just keep telling yourselves that. Just get lost, you guys. Stop being pricks. You just wanna step up to me, D? Wanna take this outside? Crusher, if you're gonna be a dick, then you might as well just leave. What? Come on, Dixie. Are you seriously trying to defend this loser? You know he once choked on a cherry, right? I don't care. Just get lost, asshole. Eh, <sighs> fine. But says no, Dixie. You're making a big mistake. Good riddance. Yeah, sorry about this too, Diddy. It's okay. But for the record, it was a really big cherry. Only by your standards, mate. <laughs> it's been a rough week, man. Man, Carol's such an asshole. Tell me something I don't know, man. I just can't believe he took credit for discovering the crapple. In retrospect, we should have seen it coming. Remember when K. Rule promised us a raise and we never got one? It's not even really about the money for me. It's that he's blatantly lying to everyone and taking the credit for what we discovered. It is annoying seeing him soak up all the glory. That reporter was really hot as well. I think there's more to the situation than just hot girls, man. The hell are you kids still doing up? 
Relax, Grandpa. It's only 10.30. You think that's acceptable when you kids have work tomorrow? Back when I was in the war, we were in bed at 9! Of course you did. There was nothing fun to do in those days. Hey, that ain't true! Back in my day, we made our own fun! All like you kids with your damn phones! Whatever, Steve Cuts. Go back to bed. Fine! I'm just getting some crapples from the kitchen. I thought you weren't gonna try him. You're not the boss of me! Man, is he ever not pissed off? There's just gotta be some way we can prove to everyone that we were the ones who discovered Crapples. Yeah, I wish there was a way we could show people the conversation. Maybe there is. Do we have to do this now? This is way past my bedtime! Sorry, I thought it'd be easier to sneak in when the place is actually closed. Yeah, man, quit being a pushy! I'm sorry, I just don't like it here at night! It's scary! Don't worry, Chunky. This'll work, trust me. <sighs> Finally! You guys are too fast! Maybe you'd have got here quicker if you didn't go back for Crapples before we left. I'm sorry, I was hungry! Shall I watch the plan then, lads? Well, we've gotta head to the security camera room and find the footage of me and DK giving the Crapple to K. Rule. Because then they'll see he likes Crapples? Then, everyone will know that they're the ones who brought him to him. Alright, that does make more sense, actually. Are you forgetting one thing? How are we supposed to get in? The place is completely locked! Come on, Chunky. You gotta think outside the box. Um, I was gonna mention that Quump dropped his key in the lunchroom earlier today. Oh. Alright, we're here. Let's get this footage. Yep. Tiny, you stand guard. Yeah, this is our blind spot. We don't want anyone to catch us. Why do I have to stand guard? Why can't I be in there with you guys? Do you even know what the word security means? Um, is it a material? If you do this, we'll buy you more crapples. Ooh, yay! Wow, he sure has a lot of cameras. Yeah, I gotta start being careful where I stand around doing nothing. Hey, oh, they got a camera in the toilet! You know that's where all the real crimes happen. Ew, this means he has footage of all of us peeing! On that note, where did you guys tell K. Roll about the crapples? It was in his office, sometime in the afternoon last Thursday. Okay, let's take a look. Come on, load the video already! This might be earlier in the day. Damn it, stop with the ads! Oh hey, look who finally decided to show up! Hey, up oh, there you are! Yes! Got him! They got two minutes to explain why I shouldn't have you two sweeping floors all afternoon! Wait, what? Did the power go out or something? No, the other screens are still on. Uh-oh. He deleted the footage! He's gone out of his way to remove any evidence that we discovered the crapple! That was a pretty smart move on his part, to be fair. God damn it! What the hell are we gonna do now?! There's nothing we can do, man. We can't prove to anyone we discovered them. I'm sorry, you guys. It's okay, Dixie. You did all you could. Um, I hate to make things worse, but, uh... Ah! What the bloody hell are them two doing here? I don't know, they must be early or something. Who the hell shows up to work at 2 in the morning? Man, the boss would kill us if he knew we were here right now. Oh well, you won't ever know. Let's just go and grab some strengths from that fridge in his office, and then head back to my place. Awesome. I hope I can find my missing key, though. Uh-oh, this is bad. Yeah, if we leave her now, they'll catch us and tell K. Rule what we've been up to. <sighs> I knew this was a bad idea! Wait, there's another route we can escape from. There is? Yeah, there's a back door, we can use that! That's right, the back door! We can't use that, it's for staff use only! Yeah, cause that's bloody important after we bloody broke in. Whatever, it'll do. Let's go. The hell was that noise? Hold on, let me go check. Wait, we forgot about Tiny! She probably just wandered off, she'll be fine. I've gotta go back for her, she could lose her job! I'll go back, Dixie. You guys just get out of here. Are you sure about that, Diddy? Don't worry, Dixie. He knows what he's doing. Okay. Thanks, man. Well, look who it is. Uh-oh. The hell are you doing here, chump? I, uh, just forgot something. Oh, yeah? Did you forget your balls? Hey, you're not supposed to be here either. Please, I'm the boss of Lori. You really think he's gonna fire me? 
Well, it sure would be nice. Face it, your badge is supposed to split Gotham. Bots get fired and replaced you just like that. Oh, uh, then you never see your precious Dixie again. Uh. <laughs> 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 the hell happened to you, man? Man, it sure is a shame we didn't get the proof that we discovered Crapples. Meh, I'm kind of over it to be honest. Yeah, me too. So what if K. Rule wants to pretend like he discovered them? We all know we did. Yeah, screw him, man! He's a crap boss anyway! Even I could see that, and I haven't even been working here for very long. He's not bad. He lets you play Tetris on the computer all day. I don't think he'd actually be happy with you doing that, Tiny. One time we all had to stay an extra hour because he forgot to unlock the door. Man, that was a long day. Hey, dudes. There you are, Funky. Can I have a crapple to cure you, please? Oh, you guys didn't hear the news. No. What happened? Oh, you guys got to see this man. As of today, crapples have been banned from being sold on Congo Island. After the crapples have been properly studied, it's been discovered that it contains a toxic substance known as petroleum and are actually extremely dangerous to eat. Oh dear. Aha! I knew they could be dangerous! You still bloody ate loads of them, you dickhead! Also, despite being fruit, they're very high in fat and calories, so could also be very bad for your health. Oh. Oops. Wow. I guess that's the end of Crapples, then. They lasted about as long as that unfunny Area 51 meme. Yep, tough stuff. Still, I wonder what's gonna happen to this K. Rule guy now. You poisoned us, asshole! Oh, come on! How was I supposed to know those things were poisonous? You've been killing our children! You're everything that's wrong with this world! I've been eating those things myself, you know! You should be ashamed of yourself! If it makes you feel any better, it wasn't me who discovered him. It was two useless employees of mine. So you lied about discovering a new fruit and took the credit? Ah, crap. Everyone, get him! Wait, look, it's Kendall Jenner. Really? Where? 